Oh, well. Yup. Wait for a second. Got the new one. Yup. Got the new one. See if you show up. Sure you will. See who shows up. Ah, there you are. Maple I.O. So, as it is what? Earth Day ever. We would do our big concert. When I lift this up. And the witches would come out. And we would set the maple. Right? Every year. I don't know. 25 years or some shit. Long time. And that was unusual because it was in the middle of Salt Lake, right? You know, it's a big deal here. <laughs> conservative culture or whatever. That was amazing. Okay. Okay. Now, Maple, we're going to pull it up. We're doing it. You're gone. Now, you will return. I know you will. Now, let's see. Maple. Let's see. I'm going to turn this down. Uh-huh. Well, okay, we're going to read this. I'm going over here. Let's see if somebody's here or I'm by myself. Nope, someone's here. All right, great. Wonderful. Now, now let's read it. Maple. Let's see. A painted pole decorated with flowers around which people traditionally dance on May Day. See? Now, connect that to a drumming circle. Circle round is ancient. Got it? All right. Holding long ribbons that are attached to the top of the pole. We all know what that symbolizes, right? Harmony. But it used to be a time where you had to prove yourself in front of the group. You couldn't just, it wasn't just automatic acceptance, right? You know? So, I'm going to sit down and read. Get some music too. But. And this is the, the energy I've been feeling lately. It's like, there's got to be groups of people doing rituals to try for protection right now especially with all the disease bullshit and whatever you know okay a maple is a tall wooden pole erected i have to say it like that as part of a various european folk festivals round which a maple dance often takes place. This is Wikipedia, by the way. I'm just reading what's in the article. I can look up other shit, but I like to do that just to see what they put in the article and, like, you know, raise awareness so people know. Okay. The festivals may occur on May Day, May 1st, or let's see, uh, whatever. Although in some countries it is instead erected at midsummer. In some cases, the maypole is a permanent feature that is only utilized during the festival, although in other cases it is erected. I'm sorry, I keep laughing, I can't help it. Specifically for the purpose before being taken down again. All right. Primarily found within the nations of Germanic Europe. So that would include uh, Belgium, because that's right next to the, that's on the borderline, right? Connected. And the neighboring areas, which they have influenced. Its origins remain unknown. No, it doesn't. Uh-uh. Germanic paganism, Iron Age. You see, old. That shit is ancient. Definitely predating Christianity by a long ways. That's saying. Okay. Chaucer mentions it, of course. You have to reference Chaucer. Thor's Oak. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm just kind of scanning. I'm not going to read all this shit. Sigmund Freud. Yeah. Sigmund Freud wrote other books. He wasn't just psychology. You know what I mean? Philosophy, other shit. 
Okay, let's see. Moda, Germany and Austria. Let's go down there. We'll see what that shit is here. Ooh, cool house. All right. All right. In Germany and Austria, you know, we still see houses here that have that style of build. You know what I mean? Where it's like um kind of panels are framed on the outside of the home with wood paneling, that type of stuff. All right. In Germany and Austria, the maypole, or let's see, Maybaum, is a tradition going back to the 16th century. I'm going to say it predates that. I'm going to challenge that right off the bat. No. No. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. See, that's the issue. Oh, here we go. Bavarian Alps. I, I also hail from there. I have some Bavarian background. All right. Let us see. All right, moving on down, baby. Brass man. Okay, yeah, 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 yada, yada. Denmark. In Denmark, the maypole tradition is almost extinct, is it? See, you hear this with language and culture, and why is it described in, it's gone. Don't look there. You know, that's what it seems like to me. Like a purposeful misleading. All right, here we go. Belgium. As I said, all right, all right. Let's see if Belgium is a bit older. Let's see. In Belgium, the maypole is called my boom or may boom in Dutch. Has settled erects is may boom on April 30th. Interesting. You see, April 30th in Brussels and let's see, Leuven, the may boom is traditionally erected. On August 9th, really? So that's more fall, right? Before 1700, all right? So that's 5 o'clock p.m., right? Planting of the May boom is the cause of friendly rivalry, okay, between the two cities dating back to 1213. Interesting. So that is also post Charlemagne as of 1066. I always use that as I look at that. I'm like, hmm. Okay. So they kept it going. All right. To commemorate this event, the city of Brussels was granted almost 100 years later the eternal right. Interesting. See, they took control of that. By John the Third, Duke of Brabant, B R A B A N T, to erect a May boom, but only if they managed to do this every year on August 9th before 1700. Five o'clock, because we did shit at night too, right? Okay. But, you know, they always show it during the daytime. How do we know? Huh? huh? Just saying, Just probably, probably is, is, you know, you know fire, fire, fire to light it if it was at night. It was at night. Okay. okay. Anyway. anyway. To steal the tree. Ah. Uh, wait a wait second. second. A first a attempt first by Leuven to steal the tree in 1939 was stopped by the police. I'd say that was staged, in my opinion. Okay. In 1974, however, a group of Leuven men found out which tree was chosen by Brussels as the year's May boom. This is interesting. During the night of May boom, Brussels, however, denies having lost the right. Uh-huh. R-I-T-E also. That's what it is. But they have it. R-I-G-H-T. You know why. As another tree was cut down and put up before 1700 August 9th. Okay. It is also customary, mostly in Dutch-speaking region of Belgium, to place a branch, also called a, mel a may boom, on the highest point, here it is, of a building under construction. So that would like be a blessing of the building, right? That it will stand long. The erection of the branch is often caused for celebration by both the workmen and the neighbors, right? So then you have Britain, all right? So as we can see, this is widespread, of course. <laughs> Anybody that comes here on a regular already knows that. That's why I don't explain some shit. You know, I'll just be like, hey, look, if you don't know by now, then you need to go look it up. All right, Britain. 
In Britain, the maypole was found primary, primarily in England and in areas of Scottish lowlands and Wales, okay, which I also hail from, thank you, all three of those, which were under English influence. However, the earliest recorded evidence comes from a Welsh poem, interesting, written by Gafid Op. Oda op David, David. Remember, AP means son of. Got it? In the mid 14th century, from previous studies, in which he described how people used a tall, here it is, birch pole. Now, birch, I have also had in essential oil form. Okay. Tastes good. I like the flavor. I know. It tastes good, though. It does. The essential oil. Okay. Now, now, literary evidence for maypole use plus for ritual use. I use tree oils. I will internally as well. Just saying. Maypole use across much of Britain increases in later decades. And by the period 1350 to 1400, interesting, the custom was well established across southern Britain. I'm going to say predates again. Maybe not the exact same way, but just that I.O. principle is ancient. That's why you constantly see me mentioning it. That's harmony, right? Harmony of tribe unity. In town and country and in both Welsh-speaking and English-speaking areas. All right. Moving on down, baby. Yeah. Okay. But as you, we can see, this is widespread. Italy's got maple. Oh. Canada, Canada. Yep. Canada. I also hail from Canada, you know, let's see, here it is, Jonathan Swift in his poem, A Maypole, describes a maypole as, here it is, deprived of root and branch and rind, yet flowers I bear of every kind, and such in my prolific power, they bloom in less than half an hour, that's the end of the little quote, all right, that's it, that's it, bam. All right. All right, it's getting cold out here. That's why I put my shoes on. Last night I let myself get cold. Mm -hmm. I know. Okay. Okay. What shall we do? Need something good. I really like Ivor. She is awesome. Oh my God. Her voice melts me. Makes me feel good. Not sexual. Emotional. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Ivor. Let's see. Let's Wake, see. Me Wake me up. I don't know. I don't know. All right. Ooh, no. We're going to switch over. We're doing Island Roads. Ooh. Ivar Far Away, live in Gotha. Okay, I'm doing that. She's next to stones. Upwork has the world's largest network. Of She's by some um, standing stones. No. Need some grounding energy. Okay. Excellent. Live in Gotha. Who nice. Sitting on the stone wall. Sitting on the stone wall. Oh, yes. Loveliness.
Only so much I can take. I gotta chill. All right, bring this over, right? All right. Sug around, see. Hot songs say it was way deep down in the pouring rain. If you could see, I'm on the way. Can you hear me now? Where you at? Deep down by the shoreline, my love, where you at? For love, shine on all. Almost too much power, I know. Oh, where for love, where? Take me down, Rob and I all must stay true. I was gonna take me down, Rob and I all. I've been deep down inside, no crying like a clown. Two faces you see. One smiles and one frowns as a tear drops to the ground. I know you've been blinded by pain. They feel love and sway. Wait for love. Will you wait for love? I was trying to lead me this way, that way, I don't need it. Shine, I know. Long ways, way. 
ancient roof town Don't try to lie to me Yeah Don't try to lie to me Yeah I told you why I don't Join on Say Why Yeah You feel love, you feel love, you feel love, word, word, follow, way down sight, you know. Shake down said We shake down said you know Thank you. I shall return. Amazing. 